Hey, 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 everybody. Thanks for joining me tonight. Um, I have a 18 by 24 inch canvas here and I have it taped up already. Um, I'm gonna do a ninja swipe. I've been watching Sarah Mack today, this afternoon while I was working. Um, so I think I'm gonna try to do a ninja swipe. Fingers crossed, I've never really done one before, so we'll see <laughs> how that works out. Um, I was trying to think. Oh, anyway, we'll just get started here. I'm using Artist Loft Acrylic Flow White for the base. I have it poured out in cups because I needed to mix up some so I was out. I am going to use Art Minds Onyx. I'm going to use Deco Arts Deep Sapphire and Deco Arts Metallic Garnet. And possibly a little bit of Deco Arts Metallic Silver. I'm still kind of undecided if I want some silver in there, but I think I probably will. I want more negative space. I'm going to do a little spot down here and swipe it up and just to kind of get some, I don't know. I don't want it like a big round piece down here, but we'll see what happens. But I'm going to flood it with white. Thanks for everybody watching. I appreciate you checking out my channel. Hopefully you like my videos and you can like and subscribe. That would be awesome. Um, oh, I think I see. Uh, a little uber. gonna say totally went blank here <laughs> um, please comment below if you have any ideas of something you want me to try a different technique um, I can definitely I'll try anything any particular colors you want me to do um, All of my pieces are for sale. I um, have some of my stuff on Etsy, on my sale page on Etsy or my shop. Um, it's Amy's Creative Acrylics there as well. And I have a sale going on right now that everything is 15% off. The code, um, it's code 1313. I'll put it down in the description as well. Um, some of my video artwork is not on Etsy yet, if you're interested in any of that, I can, I'll still honor the 15% off on those as well. If you just email me at Amy, Amy's Creative Acrylics at gmail.com, I'll put that down in my description as well. So, and that'll be... 15% off whatever one you want or if there's a commission piece you want me to do I will give you the 15% off of a commission as well um, it's the holidays I feel nice <laughs> hopefully everybody is getting ready for the holidays and can you get together with most of your family? I know it's kind of hard with the COVID right now. So much going on. It's kind of scary. I'm in Nebraska and it's getting really bad here. 
I think it is everywhere, really. I know I have some family in California, and I have some family in Iowa, and um, everybody has told me that it's getting bad everywhere. So everybody, hopefully everybody can be safe. Um, I'm just trying to put a little bit here on my edges. I'm probably pouring a lot more than I need to. Since I'm not going to put out a lot to go over my edges, I do, there may be some. Um, but since I'm not doing like a Dutch pour where I'm going to blow everything over, I want to make sure my canvas is covered everywhere. I don't want any dry canvas on my edge. You know, you probably can't see the edges of what I'm doing. <laughs> I can hardly reach all the way around here. My canvas, like I said, is a um, 18 by 24 inch. I really wanted it to go up this way. That's why I have you angled the way that I do. Um, so hopefully you can see the majority of it. I wanted it to be so you could be closer so you could see the colors and everything. Some paint on the floor here, but that's okay. All right, so let's start with blue. This metallic deep sapphire is so pretty. It's definitely one of my favorite colors. So I'm just gonna do a little spot here. And then I'm gonna pour the rest, pour some on top as just kind of layer them. You gotta bear with me because um, I have not done a ninja swipe before, but it looks fun. <laughs> you kind of decide on your colors and that's about the only control that you're gonna really have out of your art <laughs> because when you swipe it you don't know where it's gonna go um <laughs> oh maybe I'll do a little bit of silver there I guess but that's fun I like to do uh, some fun ones just different too I'm all about being different I'm definitely Not, well, I'm definitely different. <laughs> well, let's just put it that way. <laughs> but, um, I don't know if anybody, if you've watched Sarah Mack's videos, she's, she's really cool. I really enjoy watching hers. Um, I'll put her name down in the description as well, so that way if you forget what her name was, It'll be down in there, but she does the really fun stuff too. A lot of pores where she has to, I mean, she does a lot of ninja swipes. She does a lot of like ones that look like this outer space and um, hers are, I really enjoy watching hers. There's, I mean, well, there's a lot of them that I really like to watch, but when I'm working, I work from home so when I'm working, I can, I just pick um, an artist to watch that day and I kind of go to their playlist and I just kind of let them play out. And um, so you get to see like a lot of them because they have so many, you know, different videos. So I just let it play through and Sometimes you'll, something will catch your eye and you'll be like, okay, I want to try that. So that's what happened today because she had, I was watching a lot of her ninja swipes and they were actually really cool. All right, so I'm going to torch this. Get all the air bubbles out. We don't want to have air bubbles if we don't need to. And today I'm going to pour 
a little bit of white. I don't have much left in this container, but I do have another one over here if I need to, but I'm not going to pour it on top. I'm just going to kind of pour it around. So like I said, I really want a lot of white. I really want some negative space, but so this will help it kind of just flow wherever, you know, and hope for the better. I don't have, she has like these, um, I don't know if this is like the rubbery kind of, um, it's not a big one like this. Um, it's kind of like what you would use, I think, for cooking like a spatula type thing. And I don't have one like hers, but I do have this little thing that I got with some resin stuff I ordered. So I'm just gonna use this. Um, not exactly what she used, but all I have for now. Got some more little bubbles coming up here, so I wanna get those out. Like I say, I say this every video, you wanna get the air bubbles out, cause you don't want um, those air bubbles to pop once your paint's drying or you'll lose, um, well, you won't lose your, like the look of what you're going for, but it will put these little pinholes, which is, that's what it looks like when that, because when it dries, then those air bubbles will pop and then it puts like little pinholes all over. Sometimes it looks fine. It goes with whatever. If you have a lot of cells and stuff, kind of blend out. But when you're not really wanting that, you want to make sure you keep those air bubbles popped. Okay, so let's go. Let's see. Everybody pray for me because <laughs> I've never done this before. And I'm not really even sure where to start. starting to think maybe I needed more paint. Right here where the canvas you can see cut the canvas from the way it's swiped um, you don't have to worry about that because when I start moving and tilting it around it'll get covered back up even if I wasn't to tilt it it would level out so slowly it would level out all right let's start tilting here and see what we can come up with I'm just gonna kind of move it around a little bit Hopefully you can see what it's doing here. to move down that way still. Let's stretch it out a little bit. can see that hopefully it's still in there so it come over a little bit here and then we'll go back this way I 
honestly like I really like <laughs> I like this right here <laughs> and I like the cells that are popping up out of here that's pretty cool it looks like a lizard head <laughs> with the eyeball right there and this blue the cells there oh my gosh that's gonna be so beautiful when it's dry Something these are kind of messy. I suppose you probably should be wearing gloves. Yes, I know, but I'm terrible at wearing gloves. I know I should, but I think these right here, though, I'm gonna take out of there. So I would rather have that be white. some of those lines there in those spots. <laughs> I don't really want them in there. <laughs> Sometimes when you have just little dots, you can just tap your finger on top of there and then they'll, they'll go away. I'm going to, that blue is so pretty. I'll just kind of play around with it a little bit. And you can just, this is where you can really start being creative with, you know, what you want it to do. Any colors, I'll, I'm going to do a little bit of all the colors. I just dip it in there lightly. Not, you don't want to have it too thick because you, unless you want to leave like a big spot of it. But I'm just dipping it, kind of wiping off one side and then just kind of going into the color that it is, and then slowly spinning it out or whatever you want to do. Like I said, it, um, this is kind of where you can start to be creative and add stuff to it. And you don't necessarily have to do those, even if you don't want to. Just if you like it the way it will, you know, your painting came out, you can leave it. If you want to add more stuff to it, 
all the different colors. Just start playing around. You can even like, you know, go through if you want something to kind of drag through it and break something up. I just love this blue, my goodness. See how that is there? That'll fill in here in a minute. Okay, so I'm bringing you down. I need to get a new card for my phone. I'm running out of space. <laughs> Hopefully we can get a little bit of hair in. See how that looks like a bird head? <laughs> Just look at that blue and that garnet is so pretty. And that the webbing in there. Love it. I don't know. Put the comment below and let me know what you think. Um, like I said, it's the first time I've done one. But it's pretty cool. Definitely different. Got any other suggestions? Maybe what I should have tried or what you think? Or an idea of what, if you want me to try it again with some different colors. Just comment below and hopefully you liked my video today and um, you like and subscribe so you can hit that notification bell so you get notified. I try to do a couple a week. Sometimes three maybe if I am off earlier, have some time off, but um, and like I said, every, all of my pieces are for sale. Um, you can email me at amyscreativeacrylics at gmail.com or you can go onto my Etsy shop as well. There's some different ones up there that I don't have on the videos. They're all for sale. It's Amy's Creative Acrylics. That's my shop. And right now I'm running a sale. Everything is 15% off. Like I said, if you want a commission piece too, I can do that at 15% off as well. I have this sale going on until December 25th. So, but I thank you for watching. Pink says thank you. Pink, say thank you. And Khaleesi. <laughs> but um, you guys have a good day. And hopefully you'll watch my next video when it comes out. Thanks again. Bye.